Couple with two children order only one kid's meal at restaurant. The waitress immediately calls the police. A waitress called Flavian Carvalho was serving a family at the restaurant Mrs. Potato in Orange County, Orlando, Florida. A family of four walked in, and right away, Flavian sensed something odd. The couple only ordered food for themselves and one child. The other child, who was an 11-year-old boy, was not eating. And when she asked why, she was told he would eat at home. I'm going to interrupt this story right now to clarify something. You are a rude, terrible person. There can be a multitude of reasons why the boy is not getting anything to eat. Such as he already ate but is tagging along because the babysitter is not available. Odds are though this video would not have been interesting enough to share on my channel if the issue was anything close to that. Besides, this video started off with a spoiler. That's when the waitress noticed something else. And that was some strange marks on the boy's face. Instincts kicked in, and Flavian quickly flashed him a handwritten sign reading, Do you need help? And the boy gently nodded. Boom! That is exactly what should have been done. No yelling at the parents or making an attempt to kidnap the child or anything else that could have landed Flavian, or whatever her name was, in trouble with the law or put the boy at any further risk. If I ever go to Orange County, Florida, I'm definitely eating at Mrs. Potato. No one takes my wife's mouth, except me. It turned out the 11-year-old was indeed being terribly mistreated at home. The boy's stepfather, Wilson, was arrested as well as the mother. This is a horrible situation, one that is a much greater example of a terrible single mother than what we saw in yesterday's video. This one today doesn't give a lot of details, but I'm willing to bet that the stepdaddy will be getting a much harsher sentence than the biological mother. Depending on the details, I can somewhat understand, but everything that bastard did to that boy was on the mother more than anyone else. She had more of a duty to protect her child from a cowardly, monstrous animal like that, yet she did nothing, except maybe make things worse. I would not be surprised if some of the abuse was done with her permission, assistance, or guidance. And thanks to the observant waitress, the child was rescued and brought to safety. I'm going to put this next point on the person who told the AI what to say, but I'm hoping that the child was brought to safety and not bought. And now that I think about it, what about the other child? What happened to the little girl? Sure, she was being fed, but I highly doubt she went to jail with mommy. Also, where is the real father? Does he even know what's going on? Is it possible that mommy has such terrible taste in men that she regularly boffs perverts and criminals that his daddy could be spending time in the slammer? I wish this video gave more details, but then again, it did give enough to allow for a potential internet search. Maybe I can make a follow-up video soon. Until then, I have a very simple message for the mother. Fuck you.